Art imitates real life at times, and this was the case last evening when a film called 18 Hours premiered in Nairobi to highlight the challenges in the country's healthcare sector. Anukumu attended the event for the story. The long premiere of the Kenyan film 18 Hours was held last night. The event was graced by World 800 Meters champion David Rudisha, who participated in an emergency stunt hours before the premiere of the movie, which seeks to highlight the state of emergency care services in the country. Well, I read the story in the daily paper, which is in 2015 October, and after reading that article, I felt, well, this should not be happening in Nairobi. It was a story about Alex Madaga. It was sad that it happened. And I was like, what can I do as a Kenyan to uh, change this? Sorry about that. What can I do as a Kenyan to change this? So that's the process of how we made the film. It took us two years, but we are here today to world premiere. The film borrows from the real-life experience of Alex Madaga, a young man who was hit by a car along Wayakiwe. While his killer took off, leaving him for dead, Madaga spent 18 hours in an ambulance moving from hospital to hospital. Pedestrian involved in a high-speed hit and run. Emergency responders led by a rookie paramedic first rushed him to Kikuyu Mission Hospital, then back to Nairobi before he was eventually transferred to Kenyatta National Hospital. Raven paramedics were expected. We don't have an ICU bed. What? There, he was denied admission because all their ICU beds were occupied. While the rest against time in the parking lot, an available bed was found, but 18 hours too late. Hospital with working doctors. We need to sign off this patient to a hospital. Trust me, you don't want your name in the news with blood on your hands. We are hoping that we get a toll-free emergency number. We need a 999 or a 911 that works and that's accessible and that's toll-free. We are also working to educate Kenyans on how you respond to emergencies. When an emergency happens, do you call your friend, do you call your uncle, who do you call? You need to call an ambulance. I'm very happy to see uh, that there are very diverse ways of trying to promote better health care in Kenya. Uh, from, from our side, we, uh, we are strong supporters of health in Kenya. We support uh, all the primary health care facilities in Kenya uh, through uh, grants that go directly to the counties. Um, which we think is really important in creating the basis of uh, health provision. I am not giving up and I am not asking you to. While his life experience inspired a feature film, nothing much has changed. Emergency services in Kenyan hospitals still remain under-equipped, especially in public health facilities. The film is produced by Rook Pictures, directed by Kelvin Jue, and features Nick Ndede as the Rook paramedic. Yes. And Okumo NTV.